So, uh, in this <laughs> mission that we have to do um, for uh, Ergo Glast here, we have to compete in the index. Yeah, how about that? Have you done the index, people? To beat Mr. Uh. Anyu at his own game, we must first show him that we are worthy competitors. Only then will he let us enter the upper echelons of this foul index. The index is how you make money in this game, in Warframe. It's how you make the the big buckaroos, the big credits. Um, so, if you're constantly low on credits, and you're sort of like struggling to, to make enough, go play the index on Neptune. Play the index. Just spend an entire day playing the index, and you will never have money problems ever again. I have questions about Cephalon Zark. Right? Because the void, Ergo Glass. I thought you hated my index. Yes, well, since you've refused our generous offer for their return, we've come to play the odds and bring back the souls you stole. But tell me, are you feeling lucky? <laughs> so here is how the index works, okay? I just need um I just need uh some some energy here. Ah, there we go. Bam. So make myself immortal. Um You play in teams. Teams of like uh Four versus four or whatever. You shoot things, and when things die, they drop green. You pick up green. You collect green. And you put green back in your goal to score points. That's that how it works. Uh, the more green you hold, the more bonus point you get. However, the more green you hold, uh, the less health you have. So if you look at up in the top corner, I only have like a hundred HP. Ah, I'm out of ammo. Right? But if you look at the top left, you can see that, uh, there we go. I get uh, banking bonus points because I'm holding a lot. Bam, it just increased. And my health decreased. So what you want to do in the index is you want to make sure that you play something that like either just doesn't take damage or that isn't all that dependent specifically on uh, health. For example, for the Rhino, uh, he has just so much armor. And he has so many... Um, so many skills that increase uh, his armor that like I don't care because they're never actually gonna do health damage on me uh, so as long as I just you know get my iron skin up it's fine so when you play like high level index stuff there, there's meta teams you have like I don't know a DPS character like a limbo or something just racking up kills and then you have a rhino just running around and collecting all the points. Yay, we win. Why is a cephalon working for the corpus? I have to no look into that. Haven't you risked enough already? If you're referring to all the titles and assets you failed to steal after my resignation, I've never been richer. I've gained a soul and seen the truth of wealth. Anyo, the rising tides of prosperity ought to raise all who brave the ocean. <laughs> Careful, class. You might drown. <laughs> 
So yeah, the rich corpus overlords are just sending people to fight each other for blood sport and then they bet on the fights. Huh, that was weird. That was like Cephalon's arc, but he didn't have like the, the, the voice filter on. Um, but yeah, why is he Cephalon working for Nefanyo? Because like Simaris, he hides out in the Tenno relays. And then you have Ordis. And, you know... Suda, she's also in the relays. I don't know. It feels like they are sort of like this remnant from Moroccan civilization that is now aligned with the Tenno in general. Well, maybe not Suda when you think about it. I don't know. Or maybe they have wills of their own and just... Maybe, maybe Cephalon Zark just, just really likes commentating on Bloodsport. Hmm. Come on, where are they? Can't see any... Ah, there we go. So what you want to do is you want to get to uh, 15 points. Because uh, the bonus points you collect for holding lots of points... Uh, has has diminishing returns. Oh shit! A lot of stuff going on here. So once you're at 15, yeah, yeah, yeah. Once you're at 15, you should cash in. Cause there, bam, 15, and that gives me uh, uh, that gives me eight bonus points. Bam. Now, there are people who play the Index who play it wrong. And because they, at some point, they changed the rules of the game. It used to be like the difficulty ramped up with... Nah. I am. Uh, it used to be the case before. Uh, that the difficulty of the index, or like the the level of the enemies and their strength. We want our prisoners back. Wager them before this gets expensive for you. Fine, I'll throw in one of the prisoners. He's not the one I was looking for anyway. But the girl, she stays with me. Investors are eyeing those drop points. Ah, ah, ah. Okay. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. Uh, so they will, like, intentionally not score points and just running around holding, like, 50 points or something. Because they believe that, like, if they start cashing them in, that they're gonna increase the difficulty of the index match. And, uh, and that's not how the index works anymore that was true like a couple of years ago it's it's not true anymore um, now difficulty just scales with uh, time just how long how long the match has gone on for so cashing in on your index points or not is not going to change the difficulty of the match which means uh, there is a limit to how many points you should hold. Because the more points you hold, uh, the less health you have. And also, Im very importantly, uh, this thing is on a time limit. And you increase the time by cashing in. Right? There are bad Rhino players who will just not pay attention to this. And will actually lose you the match because they're not paying attention to the timer. And they refuse to cash in any of their points. And... And then all of a sudden, you're gonna run out of time in the match. And then lose! Because the stupid Rhino is running around and, and stealing all the points and then not cashing them in. Don't be that stupid Rhino, people. No. 
So here, so this is what you want to do. You want to pick up enough points where you have like 15. That's the point of diminishing returns. Where you get maximum bang for your buck. And then you go and you cash in your points. And once you've done that, let's see how many I have. Do I have nine? That's not enough. I think I need 40 to win. Yes, yes, Zark, we know. You think it's thrilling. Gotcha. So I, I think I need like one more point. Ah, there you go. Ah, oh, god damn it. Interesting performance class. But do your brokers have the credits to keep going? Ba -ba -bum -ba -bum. So that's how the index works. Oh, look at that. Got a lot of kills. Very good. So if you want to be helpful in the index, play Rhino. You're a new player, but you have a Rhino. Be the, be the one who scores the goals. Thankfully, his gambling is a compulsion. We must win her back for the Myconians. Hmm, I see. So yeah, this is the glass gambit. This is what this quest I'm is. I'm willing to bet one or two of these useless children if it means a chance to bankrupt your bleeding heart parent sequence. All those executives will surely come crawling back to me. Fodder for the index. All right, so let's let's bet some of that money. Let's bet some of that kaching. And since this is all this quest is, just playing the index back and forth, I'm gonna do a bit of creative cutting here. To just show you the interesting bits and the rest, um, you know, it's just going to be more of the same. It's going to be a lot more of the same. And I, I think there's a limit to how much of just looking at me playing the index is actually going to be interesting for you. Anyway, onward and upward to the fun bits. Keep doing that, and I'm going to have to ask Fraud Beck for a loan. <laughs> oh, he seemed happy about that. How sneaky. Well, let's see if we can out sneak him once more. I think we can do that. See that? See all of them kills? Yeah. That's a winner. Check my inbox. Don't mind if I do. Let's see. Inbox. No? But the quest said to check my inbox. So... It'll show up. It'll show up in a second or two. It always shows up. After a second or two. Ah, there we go. Finally got my my inbox message. The dark-eyed man came today. He tapped the bars and said soon we'd be put to work. Fine, I screamed at him. Only if you tell us what's going on. Are my parents safe? He just laughed at me and said something about the void. I wonder what the mumblers would do to his face. Oh boy, the mumblers, huh? So um, we gotta we gotta save Niwa. That's what all of this is about. You know how we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that by playing the index. Mm, I can feel the void in these brokers. They're full of fight. <laughs> oh, by all means, Glass, keep the credits rolling. 
Fortune is like the seasons. It always changes. Well, for you, that is. <laughs> well, we gotta save some more Myconians in the Index. You know what that means, people? That means I'm diving in, and you... I don't have to see any of it. Unless, of course, something interesting happens. Then I'll show it to you. All right, my loyal brokers. These fools wish to be parted with their credits. Let's see if we can't give them what they deserve. Buy the void. Ring the bell. Investors, ready your brokers. What happened? This is highly irregular. The odds of that occurring by accident are astronomical. This was an act of sabotage. You see that? I tried to cash in my points. And I got death zapped. How about that? That is, as they say, highly irregular. Oh, you know what? Maybe that was just an accident. So what if I try to cash in another point? Yeah, see? See, it worked this time. I bet you it's gonna work this time as well. Yeah. Yep. That was probably just some weird accident then, right? There's probably nothing strange about that, really. No, 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 no. Let's just go back to, to winning, winning on the index. Just like before. Yeah. It's gonna be fine. Hmm? I'm cashing points. I'm cashing points and I'm not suddenly exploding. So all is as it should be. I like it. But of course, this is a three round fight. Why can't I get that money? Yay, I won a round. Hooray. Well, round two. I'm sure nothing weird is going to happen in this round. The index opens for capitalization. Okay. Index points up for grabs. Okay. Let's get some points. Hey, don't you take my points. Those are my points. All right, I have some points. I'm gonna take some more points. Now, let's let's cash these points. Ah, well that worked. Ho ho ho. Silly Nefanyo. Just because I accidentally died out of nowhere in that one round. He thinks he's got the drop on me. He doesn't. All right. And now we have round three. And round three is gonna go just as well as rounds one and two. Just you wait and see. Aw, what happened? That guy, it looked like that guy was trying to cash some points. You know what? I think I'm gonna try to cash some points. I'm just gonna take this and then I'm gonna... And then I'm gonna take this. And then I'm gonna go and cash my points. Oh, that worked. Sweet. Well. Well. 
Well, I guess things are still in my favor. Now, I, unfortunately, I have bad news for you people. If you thought that this was the last index match, um, it is not. So it, this is kind of like another one of those um, Warframe questy thingies, where where it, it a little bit, to a certain extent, overstays it welcome. Where you're just forced to do the same quest. Uh, a bit too many times. <laughs> a bit too many times. Like, I understand why they, they made this quest this way for, like, thematic purposes and stuff. I think it could have been one less. I think it didn't have to be as many index matches as it, it turned out to be, all things considered. Because as you can sort of uh, guess from what I'm saying here, I'm going to have to play more Index. Oh no, my iron skin is, is bust. That means I'm, no, I'm currently not immortal. I need some energy. Now I need some more energy. Bam. Okay, I'm once again immortal. I got my iron skin. I got all the armor in the world. And we've got 20 seconds left on the index. Okay. Do I have time to cash? No, I don't. Damn it. It's fine though, we won. We are the best. In light of their recent performance, we have decided to relist your brokers. You may now compete openly on the index. You're in the big leagues now, little man. <laughs> may the void keep you from ruin. Oh boy, that's what we wanted. Now we're in the big leagues. Hmm. Now maybe we can bet and gamble for all of the Myconians. Every single one of them. 